welcome to my channel what's and wow hello friends today i'm going to show you how you can uh, fix a problem uh, it's called operation could not be completed error code 0 uh, 5 times 079 and uh, double check your printer so first option go to control panel let's <coughs> i can show you here uh, how is it giving the error so click on the printer if i am trying to uh, set as default printer it's giving error operation could not be completed error 0x0007090 double check the printer name make sure the printer is connected to the network let's fix this problem just close this tab and uh, go to run run and type there regedit registry to open the registry run as administrator Please uh, read the note before uh, editing your registry. Before modifying the registry in your computer could cause uh, correspondent error. If the modification is done incorrectly, therefore it, you will feel some pro, uh, have some problem. So first you have to uh, back up your registry file. Then you have to go for next step. So go to registry and go to uh, HK current user current user. Hmm. software then microsoft uh, then search for windows uh, windows nt and inside windows nt you will get an option current version inside current current version uh, double tap or double click and you will get an option windows here so here you will see here one option device double click on the device or right click on it and click on rename first uh, i can show you here i am opening my printer what we have to do is just copy the printer name and paste on the registry file double click and copy the printer name right click go to property then we'll, you will get the computer printer name actually here i have already copied hp laser jet dt 03 and click ok click ok if you encounter this problem cannot edit device error adding the value new content so please follow the uh, step in the video it will help you to fix the this problem if you are not able to edit the registry then choose this option otherwise your problem can be fixed for the from the first option also so again it's not fixed it's okay not an issue just open the registry and uh, go to windows option uh, windows uh, column right click properties and uh, click here add on the add option click everyone everyone click check name and uh, give everyone full permission everyone full permission apply then okay if you face the problem uh, will, uh, uh, recently i show you then do uh, follow this step actually otherwise no need to follow this step Yeah, I'm trying to reset. Okay, if uh, I'm trying to uh, set uh, as default printer, but it's not doing this. So just restart your computer and try. Oh, problem will be fixed. Just I'm restarting and reboot uh, reboot my system and again logged in here. Yeah, yeah, here you can see here problem fixed after re reboot my problem has been fixed this problem fixed but uh, in next video i am also showing you in the different pc and different window this is window 8 previously i was showing you on the window 7 so i will show you again the same step how you can edit your registry file and set your printer default problem or for the error this video is more clear than previous one that's why i have added this video this process is the same process which already i have uh, I, I had heard so just to, uh, uh, what you have to do is open the registry file do the same as you previously did uh, computer current user software microsoft windows nt 
search for windows nt here <coughs> windows nt here windows nt current version and windows and windows here mm, this okay so right click permission add in this clip i am only showing you how you can give permission to uh, everyone in the in the box so click on everyone apply and then okay so close and let's check problem has been fixed or not i hope hope this will help us to fix the problem actually so device and printer